All right, hello everybody, welcome. Did you hear how you I said welcome? Yeah. Good, they clapped, yeah. Uh, hi, my name is Mr. Gregory Dagle. I am the chorus teacher here. Um, I know some of you may say, Mr. Lake looks different. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we first off just wanted to wish um, Don Lake and Devin Aldero a happy retirement. Um, they did a lot of great work with this program. Um, we know both of them very well, and uh, they really just put their heart and soul into it. So I just wanted to recognize them and all the great work that they put in over the years. Mr. Rowe and the Jazz Band, I just wanted to say a couple special thank yous. Uh, firstly, to our superintendent and assu assistant superintendent, uh, Jeffrey Simonak and George Farrow, as well as all of our uh, district admin and our local admin here at the high school, uh, Dr. Christopher Jones, uh, and the rest of our high school uh, admin and staff. So thank you to them. Without them, these concerts would not be possible. Uh, thank you to our friends of music and just all the parents of all the band students and the chorus students. Thank you for letting us borrow your children. So, without further ado, I want to introduce Mr. Rowe and the Jazz Band. All right, thank you all so much. Uh, behind me is our uh, high school jazz ensemble. Um, I'm fortunate enough to meet with them twice a week after school. Um, so all these students take uh, their precious time out of their after school days to come and hang out with me and learn a lot about the rich tradition of jazz um, and being able to solo, improvise, and work as a team to create some really cool music. Um, so we've got a couple of great tunes for you. We really tried to stick within some uh, really great well-known standards. Uh, we'll be playing first uh, a tune called Satin Doll. It's going to feature two soloists, uh, Hannah on bare sax and Devin on guitar. This is Satin Doll. <laughs> Thank you all so much. Once again, that is Hannah on Barry and Devin on guitar. One more round of applause for them. 
takes a lot of guts to get up there and improvise a solo, so we really appreciate him coming out and uh, playing for us. Beautiful. Our next tune is another up-tempo swing tune, uh, one of our favorites from the kids uh, working on this year, a tune called Tuxedo Junction. We're also going to feature two other solos, our lead alto, Mr. Ethan Guthrie, on alto sax, and once again, you'll hear from Devin on the guitar. This is Tuxedo Junction.
Thank you all so much. We're going to take a quick, uh, quick kind of changeover as we go over to concert day. Um, and we'll be right back with you guys in a, just a few minutes. So thank you so much, and uh, let's keep this going. And behind me we have our, our high school concert band. Uh, they've been working really hard this year. We're a small but mighty group this year, which is awesome. Um, so we get to work on a lot of things uh, individually on building our confidence with our instruments. Um, and I know a lot of class time we spend uh, going through a lot of our music, making sure every single person in the ensemble is playing things, uh, playing things as great as they possibly can. Um, and yeah, we've had a lot of fun and I felt very welcomed by this group. This is my first year working with them. Um, and it's been nothing but amazing just being welcomed into the community uh, and being a part of the team. So it's been pretty great. It's been a pretty seamless transition too. I think we get along pretty well and we have a lot of fun in class. And so I'm excited to show you uh, what we've been working on so far this year. Uh, one thing that I am having the students do, this is like one time of two that you'll hear me talk during this portion. Uh, the rest of it, I like to have our students announce the pieces, tell you a little bit about uh, what the history is, the background behind the pieces, and then also give you a little bit of an insight on some of the technical challenges we might face through these pieces. Um, and I know they're all super excited to do that, right? Yeah, right, exactly. So uh, I'm going to welcome to the stage Connor, who's going to announce our first piece. is regarded as one of the most prolific performers and composers in music history. His 40th symphony reflects a dark emotion point, emotional point of his life in Mozart's life. Jeez, sorry. Showcasing his financial hardships and his troubling relations with his family, this piece begins with a soft minor melody which slowly builds up into a intention. As more members in the band enter, ultimately, Ultimate ending in a forceful set of minor chords. Although it's not a holiday piece of music, this piece has helped Kinda. our ensemble develop <laughs> our place and blend while also introducing some technical challenges, motivations through the middle section of the piece. We hope you enjoy the concert band's first piece, Symphony Number no. 40, Movement 1 by Mozart. So Connor so helpfully wanted to do that twice, so you'll actually hear him one more time, which I'm very excited. He's not excited, but I'm excited.
comes from a long and exciting tradition of songwriting, from classics like Bing, Bing Crosby, <laughs> Irene Berlin, and Nat King Cole, and to more contempor contemporary songwriters in groups like Michael Bubble, Stevie Wonder, and the Trans Servant Orchestra. The genre of music is surrounded by incredible talents. Our next piece features one of the most commercially successful holiday songs of all time. Recorded in 1994, Mar Mariah Carey's All I Want for Christmas Is You features a somber and emotional beginning which grows and builds up into a straight ahead groove which is shared to put you in the holiday spirit. This piece requires a group to read difficult and syncopated rhythms which we hear today throughout the piece. We hope you enjoy the band's next piece, All I Want for Christmas Is You, written and recorded by Mariah Carey.
many holiday songs written and created around the world, it would be impossible to fit them all into one concert. Our final piece, Holiday Favorites, attempts to capture some of those highlights from the holiday season. To perform this piece, we would like to welcome to the stage Mr. Daigle and our concert choir. This piece challenges both the band and choir to perform with great balance and blend, while also identifying their role as a melodic voice and an accompanying voice as the piece grows and evolves. We invite you to sing along with the choir and bring some holiday cheer together. Thank you for listening and supporting music here at Women Hanson High School. Please enjoy the final piece of the band portion of our concert, Holiday Favorites.
stage so that we're ready for uh, the rest of our choir portion of the concert. We're going to take just about a five to eight minute break. If you want to go into the bathroom, take a walk, walk around while we transition the stage, uh, we'll be back in just a few minutes. And I will give a, give a little siren, give a little call when we're ready to go. So take some time, chat with your friends, and we'll be right back. Um, and Mr. Daigle has been uh, key in, in working on a lot of new ideas and a lot of new things to bring to the department. And uh, we're all super excited to hear his concert player. So let's give, give it up for Mr. Daigle and the concert player. Hello, everybody. So we are going to be doing five tunes. Uh, one of them, we will encourage you to sing along. I know. I know you didn't sign up for that, but we encourage you to. Uh, so we're going to be starting off with a piece called Beautiful December. Uh, by Amy F. Burden. It's a nice, gentle sort of look around in the winter season. Uh, a lot of great energy in the piece, and one of our favorite melodies out of all the pieces that we do. So we hope you enjoy beautiful December.
class every day, like I cannot say enough just how much joy it just brings me as a person to like see that every day. Um, so yeah, thank you for letting us borrow your children, and then thank you for um, giving us the honor of, of working with them. Uh, we're going to move on to a piece called Homeward Bound. This is another one of our, our class favorites. Nice, beautiful, very folksy melody. Uh, this is a song by Marta Keene, arranged by Jude Altheis. Thank you. 
So once again, I just wanted to, um, Mr. Ronai. Mr. Oh, there he is. Okay. Uh, we just wanted to thank you again for uh, coming out and joining us this evening. Thank you for supporting the arts, um, and thank you for just letting us work with these awesome, awesome students. Um, thank you again to our district admin, um, Superintendent uh, Jeffrey Simonette, our sister superintendent George Farrow, as well as uh, Dr. Jones and the rest of our uh, high school administrators uh, as well. So thank you very much. Um, have a safe ride home. Have a safe holiday season. Uh, and thank you again for joining this evening with us.